A lot of people have been asking, where is Tati Westbrook? Well, it wasn't until recently that a photo surfaced of Tati Westbrook out and about less than 24 hours ago. Yes, I have the photo. I'm going to read you what it says on the Instagram. This is a Rich Lux exclusive. Finally found Tati. And a lot of people have a lot of questions. So let's go. Here's a photo of Tati Westbrook. She looks great. She's healthy. She looks amazing. This is the account that posted it and it was actually posted 22 hours ago so very 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 recent and the post says first thank you to the universe for making this possible if the little moments that lead up to this wouldn't have aligned as they did the results would have not been the same believe in the process second i met tati westbrook glam life guru yesterday and i'm still in awe of this moment and probably will be forever for years i've been following her growth and admiring her passion and authenticity on youtube and instagram thank you tati for being so kind and welcoming you are so loved this moment will forever be cherished. So thankful to have this beautiful serendipitous experience with my favorite person. So there it is. Tati has been seen. She looks amazing. Her skin is glowing. I looked at it and I was like, Tati looks good. So we're going to talk about it a little more. Let's go. Okay, I have <laughs> Beauty by Shelby here again. Hello. Got my popular demand. <laughs> so if you like her content and what she has to say, I'll put the link down below. So check her out. All right, we're talking about, go ahead. We were talking about Tati Westbrook. You were you literally were saying like, where is Tati? Where is Tati Westbrook? Where is Tati Westbrook? And I feel like you're not the only one saying that. I, I miss <laughs> Tati Westbrook. I, yeah, despite scandal, dramas aside, like if you, I, I take that aside, just for the makeup reviews, how yes. honest she was, and just how real she was in the video. Five days a week. I could well, used, used to be. Used to be. Used to be. Down three days. But back in the day, I used to be able to rely on Tati five days a week for a new video over some new makeup product, over like a list of the best things to get or whatever. She gave us such good content. Yeah. That's how I learned how to do makeup was Tati Westbrook, literally. Wow, really? Yeah. Her videos is the, what got me into makeup. What I like about her channel is that if you go to her YouTube channel, you could type in like, bronzer and you'll see mm -hmm. a video about the best bronzers yeah. or you can type in like i don't know milani cosmetics you will see the best, something about milani cosmetics like it was like almost a library a like catalog of just like yeah. makeup and that's what i like about it yeah it, you can go to her for her review and, there's so and i like much. that and it was really cool i, I like that about it's almost her. like like so much content like an encyclopedia of makeup, of makeup review. Yeah. like i said drama aside because people have their opinions right because like, and i right. see a lot in my comments and i see also on twitter and Instagram how people are, are all saying I miss Tati. I want her to come back yeah. And I see a lot of more of that than oh, she's so dramatic blah blah blah. Like, I see really less of that I really feel this is my opinion. I really feel and this might be you might have a different opinion than me God that's forbid. okay, okay. God forbid you have an opinion. Okay, we can have different opinions and that's okay. I can't talk but oh um, so I mean, I miss Tati I feel like she really just got caught up in something that she was a little over her head. I really do Oh, yeah. I really do. And but I, then again, she's a woman and she just kind of just like, I don't want to say she's a woman because she's emotional, but like she's a woman and she's allowed to change her mind. And exactly. one day she woke up, she was mad AF. Mm -hmm. And the next day she was over it. Yeah, she's but over it. it was like people, there was a video out there. And she had to leave the video. Mm -hmm. But I think that um, a lot of times people forget, like they're like, oh, Tati's so innocent and sweet. Tati is innocent and sweet, but you put her back into the corner, yeah. she'll come out with claws. She does. And she has. Every time anybody ever came after her brand or whatever, she she, she defended herself. She defends herself, right? And, and yeah. even times when I was just thinking like, why is she even doing I know. Why yeah. is she even defending herself? Yeah, she's, she's freaking so Tati. Like, I know. She didn't need to do that. Like, I, I don't know. That's just me. I just, I didn't think of her that like, I don't know. I just, maybe I saw her as this like immortal or something exactly. or like above being human. But I do forget she had emotions and she probably got angry and upset. Some people can have people talk about them and they just like, they just brush it off. They keep mm -hmm. going. Right. Right. But it then affected her. In effect, it affected her yeah. and she made videos, yeah. responses because of these emotions that whether it was emotions, whether it was pride or ego, whatever they got yeah. in the way, she reacted with making these comeback videos. And it wasn't like all the time. It was just like every Whenever now and then. Whenever somebody like came after her. She Remember was. she made one about the Blendiful when people were coming after how the Blendiful was and about the pills and everything. She made yeah. videos defending herself and all that. And I think the pills was, was rightfully so. She yeah. like put her foot down like, hey, you know what? There's yeah. nothing shady going on with these pills. Yeah. If you like them, buy them. If 
you don't, don't. So it's not for everybody, whatever. <laughs> uh, you know? But I want that's, volume that's, that's two. That's the video she did. She did. She like, it's not for everybody. Sorry. She's been like, video. guys, I, I'm on my smoke break right now because you're going to make five videos a week. <laughs> <sighs> Can you turn on the volume? Turn it down. I'm making a video, God forbid. Um, I'm, I don't know. I'm seeing drama with these pills. <laughs> you like it, like it. You don't uh, know. <laughs> Fine if you want. All right. Next video. <laughs> And that's it. There you go. Tuesday's and upload. And that's the video. And yeah, and yeah, get ready because there's going to be more coming. We're not going anywhere. Um, <laughs> but I want volume two of that palette that she put out. That was a good palette. It's a really good there palette. There was this one row. It was uh, it was like really like, it was nudes that were very yes. bright. I love um, that row. Yeah, everyone's palette that I've seen that has it, it's, they yes. use it. They were here, pan. Oh, those glitters are so good. And the Blendiful... Loki snaps too. I have the blendable too. Yeah, and the thing, like when she came out with the palette, it was like this row. Remember, it was like a yeah. row with that. Mm -hmm. Remember that? It was like this row. So it was row. like the different, so it was like the different formulas, right? So the sequin, the matte, the yeah. glitter, the metallic. See, she did wait. She, that to me speaks volumes of how yes. she thinks. Because to me, I was like, what? Mm -hmm. She had to, all she had to say is, girl, this is my palette. Wow. This is the color story. This is the, this is the color. If you like it, just buy it. If you like it, you like it. <laughs> if you don't, you don't. <laughs> okay. And then you, if you buy this, we're throwing some pills. Like, so, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That way you feel like you're getting a deal. And so like like that, was, it was so like thought out and meticulous. Yeah. I was like, wow, she really put a lot of hard work into this. But oh she didn't need God. to because it's just Tati. I know she didn't need to. I think that. Tati overthought her. Like Tati's like overthought her. You know how you said we're self-critical yeah. about ourselves a lot? Yeah. She overthought that a lot. She didn't need to. Yeah. She was like already great at what she did. Did that make sense? Exactly. Yeah. I remember when she reviewed, um, it, oh my God, it was a wet and wild foundation. Mm -hmm. And I love that foundation. Oh, and the photo focus foundation? That photo focus. Yeah, and yeah. she said, it smelled like paint primer. Yeah, it does. And it's so true. Exactly. But she said, but it's also a good foundation. And that mm -hmm. is the truth. It smelled bad. But yeah, it was good foundation. I loved her ability yeah. to give you, to tell you like it is about stuff, yep. but also like say what's good about it too. Cause but not be rude. Not, not like totally, rude. Yeah. 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 So like, hey, like I love the product for this, but just so you know, there's some fallout. Yeah, Or exactly. hey, like, you know what? I love the product. If you have oily skin, but if you have dry skin, probably stay away from it. And so she yeah. was able to like, really like you say, see both sides like Chanel. Yeah, I see this, she <laughs> saw both sides like yeah, Chanel. Yeah, yeah. She really did. And I like that about her that she did that. Yeah, I, I want volume two of that palette. I want like with the same concept, right? The matte, the sequin, the glitter, the whatever the different ones were with different colors. I was looking forward to having so many of those and being like, oh, here's my volume one, my volume two, my volume three. And I want those Tati. Yeah. We want those. <laughs> so back to the original question, where is Tati? Where is Tati? What do you think, where do you think, what's going on? So I think she's honestly, she lives in a high rise in Seattle now. Is that what it oh is? yeah, there was this article that got published. It said uh, she lives in a, in a <clears throat> penthouse, showplace penthouse apartment. In, in Seattle, Seattle and one of the most prestigious, richest zip codes in Seattle, Washington. But like, I just don't, how has nobody seen her? Has she not been to the grocery <laughs> that, okay, store? Okay, that's what I'm saying, there? guys. I said this the other day, I, uh, with some other video, I was like, no one's taking pictures of her. I mean, like, Jeffrey Star Costco? gets seen in Wyoming. People are going to Jeffrey Star's house in Wyoming, but they're not going to see, I mean, he lives in, you know, the middle of nowhere in Wyoming. Castro, Wyoming, love you so much. Yeah. But she lives in Seattle, Washington. It's a big city. So, okay, so either she is going out in a, in a trench coat mm -hmm. with a hat and her and a ponytail. Yeah. No makeup. Wig. Oh, big old, big, big old, old glasses, glasses too. Yeah. Big old sunglasses. Maybe a wig. Who maybe, knows? Maybe she's Big old hair. sunglasses. Um, so you really can't really know who she is. Yeah. And then she just kind of like, you know, drive through the Starbucks. Yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. So no one knows who she is. Mocha frappuccino. <laughs> grande. <laughs> Oh, milk, please. <laughs> no, milk, please. Like, try not to get seen, yeah. right? God forbid they take a picture of Oh my God, I saw Tati, girl. I saw Tati. Tati's on, back. I have, it, I have it right here. Hold on. Hold on. Give me that, that one person who's like, <laughs> I'm going to take a picture of Tati, girl. I'll send it to Rich Lex. There we go. Oh, here we go. We well, saw Tati. So there's I have 50 not, drama videos. Yeah, I have not gotten that one picture of Tati no. at the Whole Foods, at the Costco, pumping gas. At the doctor, like in the, in yeah, the you know, in the, the little, mall, the, doing you, you know, that little area where you wait in the doctor's office, like that, at the nothing. mall, like what, <sighs> paying taxes, going nothing. to the DMV, going to the bank, <laughs> going to the mall, 
go and, you know, get herself Nothing. a little Starbucks, get herself a little uh, like no, Chipotle. So she, she, she didn't do anything. Yeah. So it's kind of like, wow, what is this secret life of Tati? I don't know. The secret life of Tati was. Like, what is she doing? What is it? What, where know. is it at? I don't know. And do you think this would be a perfect time for her to come back? With all the drama that she said about James Charles, it, it puts her in a position too. Maybe that's why she doesn't want, maybe she was going to come back, but because of this, she's like, no. I just really think that Tati's name has been out of the, the lights for so long. Oh, girl, you say that, but people still talk I know, about it. I, they still bring up Cause that Because her videos, stuff. like I'm pretty sure Tati's videos still get views the house. I'm, I'm sure they people do People still watch them. Those are a great resource yeah. for makeup mm -hmm. and what you should buy and what you shouldn't. I can't tell you how many things I've bought because Tati told me to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I really And you know what? And like some people are going to be like, oh, I don't like Tati, whatever. And this isn't the video for you. That's okay. But you know, <laughs> that's okay. You're allowed not to like Tati. Yeah. I get it. But because no one's perfect, yeah. right? But if Tati was to come back, here's my question. Would you want her to just, like the video starts and she just yeah. dives right in like she never left. Like, all right, so today we're going to be talking about, da -da 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 -da. and just like talking about it. Or would you want like a explanation? I kind of like a dedicated explanation video. I think at some point I would like that, but I think that I really just miss. And maybe I just need to go right, watch the little Tati videos. Here we go. Here we go. But I really would just like her to come back and be like, "All right, guys, we have this new Kylie five five dollars no. five dollars at Ulta. This this concealer, and you know what? This is the formula. And yeah. look, and I would just I would just yeah. I just want to see her review makeup yeah. again. I miss that so much. So you would want to get back, and a lot of people right are gonna it. say that in the comments. I just wanted to get back into this reviewing the makeup. Yeah. And just and doing her PR unboxings or whatever. Yeah. I thought she was gonna come out with like a music video, like a song, because she was like doing the piano gig. Yeah. Like yeah. I would love to see her like dipping in, doing it, oh and making God. a music video, imagine? like who we shook. I mean, where's Tati? Where is Tati? You know? And I wonder like where would she have been if she didn't leave? Like would her makeup be in Sephora now? Would it still be independent? How many palettes would we have gotten? I mean, can you even buy that stuff right now? Is she even doing restocks or anything with any of that? Like I just I'm so confused. She had like such a great makeup brand that she bought. I mean we're coming up we're coming up on over a year. I yeah. Think, of her being gone. And then on top of that, like she, I don't know the financials, but I'm pretty sure she made a pretty good living just off mm -hmm. her YouTube channel. Yeah. And for that just to be gone, and then I think uh, she was suing somebody. I don't really know the details of that, and I don't know if that's gonna if that's still going on My or if that got girl. dropped. Yeah. I, I don't know any of that stuff like that. But I, I think the core audience, the core, right? Mm -hmm. Those initials that get you all the views and the thumbs up and the likes and the comments. The core audience they don't really care about that. They just yeah. want the makeup reviews. Yeah. I don't really care about the the drama. Of There's it. the group of us, right? That yeah. we just like we just like live for the drama. We like watch all the drama. We know what's going on. We follow it. But there's millions that don't. Oh yeah, they, they <laughs> don't. yeah, exactly. And he, and I think sometimes uh, people like Tati sometimes yeah. let that small group of naysayers mm -hmm. make her think like that's what everybody yeah. thinks. And that's, that's not, really not, not that's true. not the case. Yeah. yeah. That's like saying this is a small group of people who don't like you, but you have so much more to do. Yeah. But it's so funny. I think the human brain we're wired to think negatively first, but you have to you have to yourself re rewire the brain yeah. to not like think negatively. Exactly. Does that make sense? Exactly. Yeah. And it takes that's hard. It is really yeah. hard. It's super hard. And we wish to talk to the best. We want her to come back. Hi, talk to you. Want you to come back? Yeah. yeah. Let's make a video. I'm just surprised. Like I said, I just want to say I'm just surprised no one has got like a Tati sighting. I, that is honestly not even crazy. at the red light. It's, that's really weird. Yeah. It's so really so weird. then that that makes me think: Is she just at home and somebody's just running all these errands? Yeah. You know, and or is she? And then the other theory, we have Tati theories here. Mm -hmm. um, the other theory is that she was trying to have a baby. I heard. Yeah. You heard that one too. Yeah. And congratulations if it's happening or not happening, whatever. But I heard that's why maybe she's been gone out of the spotlight or YouTube. Yeah. As well as because she wants to focus on that. And a very and that's stressful true, career, yeah. and it, she had she does have endometriosis. Endometriosis. Yeah, I don't know much about that. I don't really know much about it either, but I do know that um, she would probably want to take some time away and like live like as stress free as possible. And her life has already been really stressful with all the lawsuits wow. and stuff. So maybe. If she's staying gone, maybe she's really focusing on trying to have a baby, and she has she does suffer from endometriosis. So I she's remember to take a step um, back and take care of herself. I remember Wendy Williams had a yeah. situation where, like, you know, who Wendy Williams is. Yeah, she was where she would like 
have she would like be pregnant mm -hmm. but then like something with her body like the baby would slip through mm -hmm. it would early or something she yeah. would have miscarriages and so yeah. the doctor was like just lay down in bed and so for nine months she didn't get out of bed she laid in bed and this because she had like uh, i don't know the proper words i don't want to like mess it up but she literally just laid in bed for nine months wow yeah and yeah. she and she worked from home like on the little radio thing yeah they brought the studio to her like they the recording that's system. crazy i didn't yeah. know that oh yeah it's wow. in it's in her bio biography movie oh well i need to I think, watch that. i think it's a lifetime movie I need to watch it's that. really good so maybe i was thinking well if that's some issue with tati could she not like just be in bed can you imagine just imagine this right mm -hmm. imagine her trying to have a baby yeah but she like is in bed mm -hmm. with cute pajamas and hair and, and, just the, and lights and she just has the, like, the cameras at the edge of the bed she's like yeah. hi all right so we're gonna I would like. I would like it. I, whatever we gotta do to get Tati to make a video, okay? Whatever we gotta do to get you in back. bed with Tati. Her favorite reviews and products and highlighters. Like that's cute too. Yeah, yeah. But the fact that she hasn't done that, I don't think she's going to. No. I think that like as humans, if you don't do something in six months, like a pattern or something yeah. like that, like she yeah. hasn't came back. So I wonder if she misses YouTube. If she's interested in it anymore, will she even ever come back I, to YouTube? I don't know. A lot of people think that she's not just going to come back at all. Mm. Some people are saying that she's just not going to come back. She's over it. And I don't know. I really hope that's not the case. But is is it because then then I would have to ask myself, did she make enough money off like on YouTube mm -hmm. to be like, all right, I'm done here. I'm retired. Like I'm good. I'm well, good. she might have invested some of it, and so she just has like. Yeah. Stuff going on with that too. I mean, I, I don't know, but I would hope that she did. The yeah. Some money she made, you know, invest it to where you just have something always coming in. But and who knows? Maybe her husband's working or something. Yeah. And she doesn't need to even like, yeah. do YouTube. But yeah, for sure. I don't know. Like sometimes, sometimes I ask myself, like, okay, if you won the lotto, like mm -hmm. millions of dollars, would you still do YouTube? Yeah. You still do it. I like doing YouTube. Yeah, I think I do. I think I know I would too. Like yeah. I would be like if I won like I don't know four hundred sixty-seven million dollars and 38 cents i <laughs> i would still do youtube videos and it would be like hey guys watch me spend my 487 yeah, dollars and 38 yeah. cents and that would be like my content is like yeah, just, just posting videos spending money yeah i think people would watch it because i like i like making youtube videos right so and i think she really had a passion for it too so i guess it's like like i don't know i guess we'll see what yeah. happens with that and but. then like and then i also heard other rumor is the tati theories is that her family that she showed mm -hmm. that they're she's not following them so see, oh, to me, that lets me know, like, hey, leave them alone. Oh, wow. Not necessarily, like, she's not friends with them anymore. Yeah, but her like, sister and everything that she's yeah, showing Yeah, like, her I heard rumors that they're not following each other. And I'm just, I'm thinking, well, they were had a really good relationship. Yeah. So I'm thinking it's more like, I'm unfollowing you because I don't want, like, the fandom to, yeah. like, start asking you yeah. where I'm at. That's, and I don't even know that. I'm just mm -hmm. thinking that, just being, like, a human. Well, yeah, because that. you want, like... The thing, it gets hard. I mean, I don't know. Can you imagine, know, can you imagine like Tati's sister? Like, yeah, she exactly. must be getting, where's Tati? Where's Tati? All, all where's Tati? Where's Tati? Where's Tati? All that. And it must be really or hard on the family, or, right? Yeah, yeah. It's really hard on the family. Do you start thinking, because she shared her, her, from what I know of, I think she had a, a stepson. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then she yeah. had the husband, and then she yeah. had her sister, sister that I know about. Sisters. And then I, then I wonder if people are reaching out to some of the celebrities that she had on her channel. Yes. Like, Charlotte Scott, Til Barnes, Scott Barnes, Charlotte Tilbury, Drew Barrymore, all those people. Have you seen Tati? Have you heard from Tati? Especially Scott Barnes because Scott Barnes is on there a lot. You know? Yeah. And you know what? It, for some reason, I'm getting like like advertisements for his makeup on mm -hmm. like Instagram and like Snapchat. And I'm like, whoa, this is good stuff. It's supposed to be really good stuff. It's good stuff. It's like it really looks good. good. Like it looks like it looks good. I'm the like, packaging oh, looks amazing. Okay. Like I'm like I really want to try. Like this it stuff. looks like he spent money on. Yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. And, and I, I think, trust him. He I mean, J Lo's makeup artist, honey. Yeah, I trust him. And all I think long. Scott Barnes is, is one of those brands <laughs> that people aren't talking about. Like why aren't people talking about this brand? And that's kind of crazy too. Yeah, I don't know. I just rambling. Like this yeah. video literally just was like, where's Tati? Where's Tati? To where like where are we at? Like eight, eighteen oh, minutes. Eighteen minutes. Of we where's Tati is, girl. I want to know what you guys think. Yeah. Where do you think Tati is? Have you seen Tati? Have you seen Tati? We have a Tati's tip line. It's my email down below. Just like hit it right there. <laughs> Send me a picture or screenshot of her. Like 
I don't know, giving blood, who knows? Who knows? <laughs> Donating plasma. You know, even, even if it's a picture of her, like, at the Walmart holding a potato, like, you know, or a, a tomato or avocado. It's like, man, is, is it, has it bruised? Like, have you seen her at Ulta? Have you seen her at Ulta? I think she would stay away from that. Oh, uh, yeah. Maybe that's smart. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's probably smart. You know, picking her nose at the mall and lying at Thirsty's and lying at, at Smoothie King. Getting her little pizza at Sbarro. Yeah, getting a pizza at Sbarro, buying a hot dog on the side of the road. Like, anything. Even if it's a picture of her in a flat tire or somewhere, because you know that happens. If or you're her. in Seattle and you've seen Tati, let us know. Yeah. You let put it in the email and also like yeah. put it down there. And if, if y'all guys see it, like it because they'll put it to the top. Yeah. Look at me that one comment. Well, I did see her pumping gas. Well, it looked night. like her. She looked like she was kind of. There, here we go. Watch the, the comments. Well, then she looked like her and her husband weren't doing too good because he looked upset. You know, that's how it starts, right? I think they're on the rocks. And the, the, and one, the comments are trickling out. That, that one replies. comment that has like no picture. Mm -hmm. It's like, yeah, I agree. I saw mm -hmm. it too. And it's like, girl. <laughs> and it's like <laughs> random. And then it's like, oh yeah, girl. And then I saw him doing this there at the Costco. And they were doing this. And then she rolled her eyes at him. I'm like, and then the next comment, I was the cashier at the Costco. And I, and she was kind of rude, but yeah. <laughs> Me, it goes on and on there it goes, and that's how you go. That's just the, the rumors and the drama. And that's how the drama videos get made. And I was, and I pulled the carts in the parking lot of the Costco, and she didn't even put it back in the rack where you put. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Supposed, she just left she it just out there. She left it out there for anybody to get to run it. into. She talked to Westbrook does not take her carts back. And the YouTube cart community is going to be shook. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, no, because it'll go. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. And then her nails wasn't polished, so, if, <laughs> so that must mean she's going through something. It had a little chip in the nail. I know, she needed to refill. She girl. needed a refill. Okay, I'm done. I'm too much. I'm too much. Okay. So if you like, if you love and like me by showing, put the link down below. Please check her out. She does amazing videos. What, tell them what kind of videos you do. So we do a lot of drama commentary stuff like this uh, over here on the Tasha's <laughs> channel. We do a lot of shopping vlogs like in Saks Fifth Avenue or Marshalls, yeah. Ross, Target, Walmart, wherever really, girl, wherever I go. And then we also do like food uh, tasting like reviews. So Starbucks stuff, Dunkin' Donuts stuff, like McDonald's have that Pokemon thing. Oh my God, yes. That. Yeah, so we do all that kind of stuff on my channel. And just the, a random occasional little vlog as well. Yeah. Follow me along on my channel. So day. check her out there, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye.